Hey everybody, it's Ashley, Carolina Trailer Sales, carolinatrailersales.com. We're located in Colfax, North Carolina. We are by appointment only, and you can reach me at 828-773-4500. Please like our Carolina Trailer page on YouTube. So if you don't mind to definitely like our YouTube page, if you're seeing these videos, we'd greatly appreciate it. So this is probably one of the nicest sundowners I've ever had on the lot. This is an 04. However, this is an all aluminum 04. So this is an aluminum skin, frame, everything. This is actually an 8012 Sierra Sunlight 720. This trailer is the one with the bunkhouse in the middle. So this is a super neat trailer if you're wanting to sleep multiple people, if you have kids or you have several people that go with you, um, this would be your trailer. So this is a three horse, eight wide, seven tall, Again, all aluminum, 2004 Sundowner. This trailer is in immaculate shape. It has every option on it that could have been put on it back in 04. So I'm just gonna kind of point out a couple of things. Um, it does have a hydraulic jack. It does have a stainless nose. Again, this is an all aluminum Sundowner. It actually is in excellent shape on the outside and the inside cosmetically. I cannot really point out a bunch of dings or fenders peeled back or anything like that. On this side, you'll see the door on this side goes to the bunkhouse. You can use that as a mudroom for extra storage, even if you don't sleep multiple people or you only do maybe periodically. Um, it gives you a ton of storage. It's got the the um, slide out step. It does have an escape door. It does have the big drop windows with bars. You can't see, you'll be able to see in my pictures, but there is one manger door um, with storage all the way across these two. So you do have manger storage with one door. This does have a propane generator. So propane generator is in the rear tack. It does work great. Swing out saddle rack, rear ramp. Horse box is immaculate. This horse box is in great shape for an 04. It does have the full, let me go back to extend, extended. It does have the full divider. So the lower and the full divider. So um, if you needed to stack multiple things in that first stall um, for storage wise, hay and whatnot, you've got uh, obviously a complete box um, divider. It makes a complete box, I guess is what I'm saying. So this is a more expensive divider. It is a full divider. It does have a walkthrough door. The padding is all in great shape. It does have the big bus drops on the rear. As you can see, the horse box is in great shape. There's one spot, one spot there that the rubber is rubbed. But other than that, that is the only spot. It's got lights on the inside. It does have roof vents. Again, the horse box is big. These sundowners have big horse boxes. Um, these older sundowners are actually excellent built. I mean, they are built strong, solid. They're not really, in my opinion, built the same as this trailer. Actually, nothing is, but um, you've got rear load lights. Kind of step around the other side. There are some kick marks on that door. It's just merely cosmetic. Um, it did not come through, of course, on the other side, but just wanted to point that out. Fully extruded, so that means the, the ribbed aluminum all the way from front to back. That is an added up, upgrade option in most trailers. Does have a power awning with the actual uh, cover to uh, keep the sun from deteriorating that awning skin. You'll see the two windows. Those are the two bunk beds. So those are the two bunk windows. So the front is a 12 foot and then you have your bunkhouse, um, I know people are gonna want to know weight and they're gonna wanna know box length on this trailer. Obviously, I'll have to grab those things for you in the ad. Um, can't really grab those right now while I'm doing the video, but we'll get that information to you. As I said, spare tire, hydraulic jack, battery box, two propane, ta propane tanks, excuse me. Guys, this trailer is immaculate. Slide out step here to go into the living quarters. 
Okay. This one, as I said, has everything. So this trailer has a microwave. This trailer has an oven. This trailer has a big fridge. This trailer has, I'm gonna say a retro TV up there, guys. But it does have a TV. It's got a flat screen TV in the back in the bunk area. I'll also note that this trailer is not dated. So the interior honestly looks great. It is not dated back to 04. The decor, I guess, is what I'm speaking of. Um, so the couch does make a bed. So here's one of your sleeping areas. It does have two mirrors. Got storage here, microwave, big fridge. Cabinets up above, double sink. There would be the antique TV. <laughs> so in the living quarters, it's got great space being a 12 foot. What I like is you've got a bathroom that separates you in the back portion. It's like two bedrooms essentially. Um, so if you have other people staying with you that you want some privacy, say, I mean, even a, a set of people that are a couple, I mean, yes, they'd have two twin beds, but it's still, there's some privacy there with the, um, door that shuts to the bathroom. All right. So you open this door and it actually goes into the bathroom, which is a good size bathroom considering it's got a sink and vanity cabinet space there. got a pretty good size shower squared off shower here so this is the middle it also has ducted AC so you see the the vents are in the bathroom and the vents are back here in the bunk room so um, bunk room is back here like I said a ton of space has its own separate door um, you've got the two uh, twin bunk beds and you've got the storage underneath Flat screen TV, you got a big wardrobe storage. I mean, storage, storage. That's one thing that we don't have today in our trailers today is a storage of back in the early 2000s with these trailers. So um, walk through door to the horse box, spin around. You've got two mirrors in this compartment as well. If you show and you show with multiple people, kids, um, this would be a great trailer. You've got obvious, obviously a door to enter to this back room as well. So, I mean, that makes it, you know, again, the privacy issue where you have two separate compartments to this trailer. Great trailer, guys. Um, I, I honestly, it's probably one of the nicest living quarters trailers that you can sleep multiple people that I've ever had on the lot. And that would be in nine years of business. So nice trailer, super nice trailer. Kudos to the person that owned it originally, which was a short amount of time. The second party that purchased it, they babied it, took very good care of it. They traded it in on a bigger trailer. That's the only reason, a bigger LQ. It's the only reason that it was traded in. They really, really liked the trailer um, and had no, no bad things to say about it. All right, so just to reiterate, 2004 all aluminum sundowner bunkhouse edition. Um, excellent shape, three horse, propane generator, power awning, hydraulic jack. This thing's got great, great options. It's not going to break the bank either. Super nice trailer. Carolina Trailer Sales, carolinatrailersales.com. You guys have a great day.